go by logic. MS Excel is a software that is used in every business, no matter how small it is or how large it is. And if you know Excel, you know how to use MS Excel, you can build your career and earn good amount of money as well. In this video, I'll discuss 5 careers that you can build if you are proficient in MS Excel and numbers. The number one is career in finance. Investment bankers, financial analytics, and investment research professionals rely heavily on Microsoft Excel and its built-in financial formulas. These financial formulas help make important calculations that support asset valuations, financial reporting, and investment decision making. Finance professionals use Excel to analyze financial data such as revenue, expenses, and cash flow as well as to analyze non-financial data such as customer data or market research. And for all these things, if you are good at Excel and you are good at analyzing data, you can build your career in finance. So that's the number one. Number two is digital marketing. Digital marketing is how your ads come on digital platforms across the internet. The art is to sell your product, services or anything you do on digital platform is called digital marketing. But digital marketing is not an art actually, it's a science. A science that is based on numbers. Everything is measured. What is the CTR on your ad? How many people click on your ad and land on your website or landing page? What is your conversion rate on that landing page? How much money have you paid to click on your ad? Is it based on CPC or CPI? And all of that is something that is visible to you, provided to you, and then you have to work through that to make sense of that. If you want to learn digital marketing, you have to build a relationship between you and numbers. And that comes through your understanding of MS Excel. So the digital marketing is the second job. But if you are an expert of Excel, um, let me clear one thing. To be a digital marketer, MS Excel is not the only and one software that you need to be expert of. It's just one of them. There are multiple other software and tools that you need to learn to be a digital marketer. But that's another topic. Now moving on to the third career path and that is social media analytics. If you create content on social media or you know someone that create content on social media and you want to work with them, let's say, because there are so many content creators and personal brands these days, they all need one strong analytical person, a person who can tell them that on every week, what happened on every platform, what happened on LinkedIn, on Instagram, on Twitter, on Facebook, how did the reels performed, the stories, the post, what happened on YouTube, what was the average video duration, what was the CTR or click-through rate on thumbnail? From where did people watch your videos? From which platform did they watch? All of that is just data and that data needs to be understood because you can get that data easily. But the real work is to get the insights from the data. So if you are interested in data and you are also a pro in MS Excel, then you can build your career in analytics. Number four, product analytics. There are so many applications that we use. Those apps or tools could be at a very large scale like WhatsApp, LinkedIn, YouTube, Instagram, or they could be at a small scale like a startup. A measurement of all of these apps is very important that comes on a dashboard and it comes on the backend. So the owner of the app knows how many users logged in, for how long, from where, or for what speed, using which device, what they are clicking and how much time they are spending. All of that is called product analytics. A role where if you are aware of data, love MS Excel and of course love products or technologies, then you can combine these three skills of yours and convert these skills into your career where you can tell somebody after looking and analyzing data that, um, for example, I can see from the data that from the Japan, people spend most of the time on our app at 9 p.m. and then you go deeper. This is just an example of what a product analytics person could do. And finally, role number five is data entry. I have created a video on how to do data entry work in MS Excel. Please go and watch that video if you want to learn how to do data entry work. The link is in the description box. 
okay so data entry is a very basic role but a role that almost every business needs the data could be of any kind it could be customer data finance data marketing data hr data employee data student data sales data or any other form they need people who can enter their data accurately and error free and maintain and update it and all of that is a wonderful opportunity especially for people who do not want to work from the office but they prefer work from home and have flexible hours because there's no need to do something in real time but what is required is that you should know all of the excel formulas and functions so you can do that data entry work quickly because um for example if i ask you to send an email to people who have our product subscription from past one year and you start to look for those people one by one and then you won't be able to do that let's say i give you the data of 500 people you will be looking for those people manually and it will take you a lot a lot of time but if you knew there's actually a way in ms excel to find those people quickly then your work can be done in seconds and you will be more faster with your work and more productive with your work get paid the same and the company will love you for what you do all right so these were five job roles that you do if you love data proficient in mx excel you can pick up as a student as a freelancer or as a young working professional okay so i have told you that it's important to learn ms excel now one more thing i want to tell you is that please visit our channel to learn ms excel our channel is about providing high quality tutorials on ms excel you can find playlist on excel for beginner courses and excel for intermediate users there are playlist of those and also you can learn data analytics basics and essentials and how to create a dashboard on ms excel and a lot of other things so visit our channel now and start learning excel i hope this video was helpful and i'll see you in my next video